everyone, welcome to my channel. Um, welcome to this new series where I'm gonna solve some TypeScript challenges and I'm gonna walk you all the way through it so we can improve our TypeScript skills and have fun doing that. In this video I'm gonna help you get the project set up and we're gonna solve the first example challenge, so let's get right to it. To start with the challenges we're gonna head to a web page from a GitHub project. This is a GitHub repository that contains a lot of challenges as you can see here in different levels of difficulty. I have the link in the description for you and to set it up we need to first obviously clone the repository. So let's start with that. Okay, the um, repository is cloned and we're gonna head into the folder to install all the dependencies and then generate the challenges so we can solve them. With pnpm install we can install all the dependencies which should be super fast. And after that we can use pnpm generate to generate the challenges. We have to select the language, gonna pick English, and then the challenges are quickly generated and we're gonna find them in the folder playground. And here we have one folder for each difficulty level and we can basically start with the challenges now. To demonstrate how the challenges work, I'm, we're gonna solve the Hello World challenge together. This is an example challenge which is, which is extremely easy but it demonstrates how it works pretty well. So basically we always have a block of code that we are supposed to change, like this one, where it says you type hello world equals any and then we have a block of tests that need to pass with our solution. So let's check it out in the code editor. Here we have a block of code where we can make changes, write our own types and all that. And here we have a block of tests and all the tests need to pass if we have a solution. All right, and then let's do this. This is supposed to be a string, so we're gonna put a string. Then we can immediately see that all test cases pass. So this seems to be the right solution. But on top, we can check it out here via this URL. There are solutions posted and we can just pick the first one in English. And here we see, okay, type hello world equals string. Seems like we did a good job. In the future, we're gonna solve some more and definitely some harder challenges where we definitely have to do some type acrobatics and really get into TypeScript's type system and use different methods to really juggle types around. If you want to follow along, leave a like and subscribe, you know the deal, and see you in the next one.